The Sport Life Show is on the air of the M1 Global TV channel. Alexandra Abramova is here with you. Hello. On May 29, the Gorilla MMA Series will hold the 33rd event in Barbija. Elite Playground, magnificent heavyweight selection, two female pairs, familiar names for the fans of the series, and a title fight for Alek Popov. And now we'll discuss the main event of the evening. Oleg Popov is widely considered one of the most promising heavyweights in Russia. On his account, there are 10 victories and only one defeat. Among them, there are three serious events. On the seventh event, Oleg won Denis Orkhirev with a technical knockout. The 21st event in Sochi gave us a spectacular victory of Popov over Belarusian Sergei Alexievich. In the second round, Oleg successfully had a choking reception, forcing Sergei to knock in the sun of the defeat. At a 26 event, the Russian heavyweight fighter did not have a problem with Abdel Wahab Mohamed from Egypt. Oleg needed just over three minutes to record his third early victory in the series. Exactly this winning series gives him the right to fight on May 29th for the winner bout. This is a great opportunity to speak about himself even louder and go to get the first Guerrilla MMA series title. 29 мая на турнире Барвиха Лакшери Виллидж Олег Попов, один из сильнейших тяжеловесов, который выступает сейчас. On May 29th at the Barvika Luxury Village event, Oleg Popov, one of the strongest heavyweights performing now in Russia, will meet Dennis White Container Series veteran Marcus Brigaga with a record of 10-1. His record is 13 wins and two losses. The two bright guys who are in the top of the heavyweights who are willing to meet anyone will be headliners of the 33rd Guerrilla MMA Series event. I'm sure you'll enjoy the event. Oleg Popov, who cannot be confused, who constantly moves forward, who always seeks in the chance to attack, and Marcus Brigaga with the killer punches and the ability to fight on the floor of the octagon. Who will be the best, we'll know soon enough. Watch live broadcast of the M1 Global TV channel. Now let's talk about rival of Oleg Popov at the upcoming event in Barvija. Brazilian Marcus Brigacau will become perhaps the most difficult opponent for Oleg at the series events. A fighter with a record of 13-2 named Corgis may have ended up in the world-leading UFC league. UFC. Marcus Brigacau started his professional career in 2017. That's when the win-win heavyweight series started. Marcus named to win 11 consecutive victories, bringing him to the attention of Dane White. Brazilian honored to perform in the Dane's White Pretending Series show in 2019, which gives a chance to the most prominent members to make their debut in the UFC. The rival of Courageous was ex-fighter of Bilater Jamal Pogues. This was Marcus' first career defeat. His opponent celebrated victory by a unanimous decision of the judges. Failure on a big project could psychologically break a young prospect down, but Marcus highly won the next fight with a technical knockout. Well, the main fight of the evening and the title fight for Alec Popov against one of the most difficult rivals of the series, Marcus Brigagel, should give us an unforgettable spectacle. Besides the title fight for Alec Popov, there are also interesting fights. Let's turn to them. In the comment fight of the evening, we will face an interesting confrontation of heavyweights. Alexander Podmarov will fight with Ruslan Mejidov. Both fighters are well known to us from the performances at Guerrilla MMA Series. Podmarov represents the Storm School and the Storm Shlemenka fight team, team of legendary Alexander Shlemenka. At our 21st event, which took place in Sochi, the Texture heavyweight made his debut in the series, recording an arsenal, a draw decision against Marcus Sanov. And Alexander celebrated his first victory in our series at a 25th event in Momsk. In the third round, Magomed Ali was defeated by a knockout. The event will take place in Moscow on May 29th. It will take place in Barvika Luxury Village. I'm preparing, as always, at the Storm School under the leadership of Alexander Shlemenko. We analyze the opponent, watch his fight. We have chosen tactics for him. Ruslan Majidov is an Azerbaijani fighter from Kudal who lives in Russia, has repeatedly won the prize of Russian championships in the sport. 
and in the MMA at a professional level, he began to try himself in 2017. With four mixed martial arts victories, Ruslan made his series debut in the 21st event, but not really successfully, in losing by knockout to Kirill Kornilov. And this is another entrance into the octagon in our series. The only thing that can be certain is that it's difficult to predict how this fight will end. My name is Ruslan Mijidov. I am a fighter of the MMA Profi Center of Martial Arts, the city of Nizhny Novgorod. Kudo Master of Sports, four-time Kudo Champion of Russia. I can tell you about MMA series that it is a very good organization that is rapidly gaining momentum. And what I can tell you about the fight is that two strikers will fight in the cage. The fight will be colorful. The audience will not be bored. I think we'll show you all we can. The third most important fight of the evening will be the confrontation of the star of Guerrilla MMA series Sergey Babrushov with Zalimhan Yusupov. Appetage, the non-standard way of fighting, the ability to turn the course of the fight at the most difficult moment. All this is about Sergey Babrushov. The more error is always ready to make the show. Babrushov made his stop at in Guerrilla MMA series in 2020. At the seventh event of Russian McGregor, as many call it, successfully had a choke in the fight against Daniela Vaganov. A bit later, there was an unforgettable fight with Alexei Lipunov and the first defeat in the series. For this confrontation, both athletes received the Fight of the Year award in the viewers' vote of the MMA Series Awards 2020. Then Sergey proved stronger than Vladimir Lupko at a 21st event in Sochi. Just a month ago, we witnessed an extremely difficult fight for Babership. Losing the first round to Ramazan Amirov in the main fight of the Guerrilla MMA Series 30, the fighter spread his wings and unexpectedly snatched the victory with a choke in the second round. Incredible performance, thanks to which Babrushov gets a place in the super event in Berbiha. His rival is Zalimhan Yusupov with a record of 13-6, who has experience in series organizations, a universal fighter who won by techniques and knockouts. It'll be hot. I'm Sergei Babrushev. For now, I'm in Murom, but I'll be in Barvika on May 29th. I'll fight on the MMA Series 33, play live broadcast and watch. The full fight card of the Guerrilla MMA Series 33 Barvika luxury event you can see on your screens. An interesting standoff is expected between Sudarbek Kuzak and Zahur Gajibabayev, who are acquainted with viewers of the channel by performances in the M1 Challenge. We will also see another Storm Shlomenka fight team representative. Alexander Shurkevich will face Islam Kamaldinov. A total of 12 fights. Only one fighter out of 24 is a debutant. This is rare. We are used to, to the fact that every Guerrilla MMA Series event is a launch pad for several fighters just starting their way to MMA. We remind that the Guerrilla MMA Series 33 Barbica Luxury event will take place on this Saturday on May 29th in Moscow at the Barbica Luxury Village at 7 p.m. Moscow time. If you'll hurry up, you can still get tickets. If you're away from Moscow, you can watch a live broadcast on the M1 Global TV channel or on MMA-Series.com website. In conclusion, we would like to draw your attention to the women's fight. There will be two of them, Victoria Sklarova vs. Diana Varabyova and Maria Artukhina vs. Gulnazi Komorova. Maria Artukhina has already participated twice in the Guerrilla MMA Series events. At first, she had a draw against Katerina Makarova, then a victory over Alona Pimenova followed. Her professional record is three victories with two losses and one draw. Her opponent, Gulasi Komarova, has the perfect record, three victories with zero losses. In our events, Amarova has not previously performed and clearly does not intend to lose zero in the defeat column. We will also see Victoria Sklarova and Diana Varabyova for the first time in the Guerrilla MMA Series events. But if for Sklarova it will be the seventh fight in the professional MMA, then Varabyova is the only debutant of the upcoming event. My name is Victoria Sklarova. I'm a participant of the Guerrilla MMA Series 33. Our training is coming to the end. I'll see you on May 29th in Berbiha.
And I, Alexandra Abramova, say goodbye to you. It was the Sport Live Show. See you on TV.